Oh. There you are. <laughs> huh? Oh. Are you... Boyd, are you okay? <sighs> now you look fucking amazing. Hang on. Hang on. Wait a second. What? I just went and got cleaned up. I came off of work. I didn't get more hurt. I didn't get more hurt. Uh-huh. You didn't get shot nothing? No, not tonight. Promise? I promise. Okay. I have a reason right, for uh, that. Alright, I just thought maybe you were in a dr No knee wounds or nothing. No, I literally went and changed out of my dirty, sweaty work clothes. Uh-huh, That's all. Uh -huh. You ain't trying to hide nothing? Alright, alright, I believe you. Alright, alright. Um... <clears throat> Yeah, uh, you wanna wanna ride with me? I'm um, sure. I do that. Yeah, let me help you up. Hold on. Sure. I almost ripped him off. <laughs> hey, yeah. How's your day? Oh, that was a long one. A hard one, actually. Uh, oh, yeah? You made it, though. My uh, They're yeah, very the... close calls. There's... Well, don't tell me that. And it's the truth, isn't it? And it's <laughs> dealing with the sorts of people that we're dealing with it. I mean, we had a point where we had to walk away from someone who we know to be very violent who had already done bad things, but we couldn't engage because there was five of us and two of us couldn't use our long arms at the moment. We knew that we'd right. be outmatched and that we'd all get injured or worse if we tried to do anything. And well, I'm glad you you didn't do that. That's that's good. That's good. And it's very frustrating because we know that they're likely to go out and hurt more people. You'll get him eventually, though. Right? I mean, we can only hope, boy. Last time this uh, you'll was get out, him. he was out for months and months harming people for ages. Well, how'd you get him last time? Well, I didn't get him. Well, there's the... See? That's the difference. They, they didn't have you last time, <laughs> but now you're there. You'll be getting him up and catching him and locking him up in no time. Uh, That's right. Maybe. No, this fellow Robbie Game changer. Before. He's some giant criminal. Uh, you heard of Summers? Nah. Well, he was very well known across the crossing when I first came out. Hmm. He used to run that oh. entire the entire city of Van Hoor. It was it was like a criminal uh, city, I suppose. And everyone there would back him up when the law came in. So they could never really root him out. You'll get him. Aye. If you don't get him, just keep, just give me a, like a few more weeks, and I'll be right there, and I'll give you a hand, right? I hope so. I'm really, really hoping for you on that point. Yeah, me too. I don't really know where I'm going, just so you know. I'm just kind of following a road. I was wondering if you knew where you were going. Yeah, well, we've, we, we've been over this before. I don't really know what the fuck I'm doing or where I'm going. It's it might even... be... Uh, just just hold on tight. You know, you know, body warmth and all that. But the, the <coughs> thing is, this might be my biggest problem. If I do, you know, get to work with you. Mm -hmm. I, 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 I get lost easy. You know, I'm new to these lanes. I, I have no idea where the fuck I'm going. You know what? We, we, right, we're going okay. left. Okay, See? this is going towards Lake Olenjila. Yeah, well, there you go. We're going to Lake Olenjili. There you go. <laughs> what? Nothing. I just thought it was funny how you said it. That's all. 
All right. Well, you know, you make it. I, I can make fun of the things you say. I'm not making fun of it. I just thought it was funny. All right. Well, it's funny when you, you say something that I think is funny. I don't even know what the fuck you're saying. Okay, well, I don't think it's I when you say. I I think you say. You like. I, I don't. I don't know. I, I I don't. Something. Something. Well, it seems like you want to pick on the way I, I say I don't know, which is I didn't no, can. No, no, no. you already know. I did I can. I did I can. That's it. What the fuck does that even mean? I did I can. It means I don't know. I did I can means I don't know. No, I didn't can. I didn't can. I, I didn't can. I didn't can. I didn't. What's it, what's it mean? It, it means, means I don't know. I don't know. It's not English. No, it's a... Uh, that's a farm of Scots. I didn't can. It's like a... It's sort of like a sling, but more than a sling. Oh. Well, I will say it's, you know, it's, it's kind of cute. Neither am I, Jimmy. Okay. Well, it's just the way I grew up speaking, you know? Yeah, well, you know, at least it sounds kind of cute. I mean, just fucking shit I say. Like, fair income? Like, what the fuck is that? Like, I'm Australian, I don't know what the fuck that is. Well, I know what it is, but... Fair income? It's not a... Fair income, yeah. <laughs> what, like you I've, heard of that before? I, th I feel like I've heard it before, but not, not very often. Yeah, fair income means, uh, like, uh, seriously or... Just uh, be for... aware there are grizzly bears in the forest up here. Ah, don't worry about grizzly bears. Alright, we'll go across here. Uh, no, don't go that way. <laughs> that, that is... I've known there to be right, packs right, right. of cougars all out right, that all way. Alright, we'll go up this way. This way then. Yeah. Be, no, don't... No, not this way. Stay on the road. You stay, <laughs> right, on the we'll road. stay on the road. Uh, alright, we'll stay on the road. Gonna, just, uh, there's a few places. I'll tell you where to avoid me. I really hate bears. Like I mean, I, I mean, I, I got a, I got a cattleman. That'll help. I, and I've got a Schofield, and neither of those was gonna do anything against a bear. We climb up a tree, we'll be fine. They can't climb trees, can they? Right? No, they can't climb trees, but they can run as fast as a horse or faster. And the horse likes All to right. throw you off. Yeah, we got bears over in Australia. We've got the koala bears. We've got the drop bears. Aren't the koala bears wee grey things like? Yeah, little little fluffy things. Have you had a drop bears though? No. What's a drop bear? Oh, a drop bear. <laughs> All right. Well, imagine a koala bear. Right? Have you seen? You seen what they look like? You seen a picture of them or anything? I, it's sort of cute, fluffy. Yeah, animation. yeah, yeah. So it's like that, but twice the size. They got fangs like 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 a, like a fucking bat and a serpent. <laughs> And what they do is they sit in the trees. When you walk underneath the tree, they drop on top of you and they just start sucking your neck. Well, that's horrifying. Oh, yeah. You, f you don't want to be walking around trees in Australia. Those fucking drop bears will get you. Well, I've never heard of those before. That's terrible. Well, it's not something we like to tell people, you know. We're not kind of, we're not, we're not very proud of it. It's kind of fucked up, actually, if you think about I mean, it. Don't you want to warn people about if they go walking around the trees, these, bear, these drop bears are going to drop on them? Well, yeah, but, you know, you don't want to scare people. They suck blood. Oh, they just suck everything. The fucking, the, the throat, the, the tongue. Oh. You don't get right well, they in don't there. Don't go through, don't go, so go over towards that camp there. Because right, there's right. a bear over here. There's a cave up there. Yeah. Oh, right, right. Well, right. well they, yeah, they, they lingers near the entrance to the cave. Oh, okay, all right. I'm trying to find a nice fucking place, right? <laughs> There's a place out here that I wouldn't just see at, but oh. it's a... It doesn't have a back door on it, and it has no place to store anything, and, of course, the bears and the wolves out here are rather dangerous. Well, this is kind of nice. Look at look at the little purple flowers. That's not, that's not bad, right? Oh, I know. It's gorgeous. The lupine fields here. All right, we'll, we'll go here, and we'll sit on the rock right there. There you go. Perfect. Sure. Beautiful. Yeah. This is, uh, yeah, this is nice. No trees. No bears. <laughs> no wolves.
Nice view, huh? Oh, I've always loved Big Valley. It's gorgeous out here. Yeah, so have I. I've only seen it. Well, this is my first time seeing it, but really, is it? I, yeah, I like it. Too. Well, I haven't really explored that much. You're definitely gonna want to get do on doing that if you're going to be a a woman. You've got well, to that's all part of the training, the right? Uh, I. But I can tell you that one of the first things that will happen to you once you become a cadet is they will say, "All right, cadet, lead us to." And they'll, you know, give it whatever location we're going to, they'll want well, you to lead. And I tell you what, that's going to be entertaining. If you're there, you're going to love it. Oh, I, I've watched a lot of cadets panic at that moment. Oh, I won't panic. I will definitely be very confident as I just choose a road and take it. But I tell you what, I've been practicing. I've been practicing my cover taken. Look at this. Your cover See this taken. rock? Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So imagine we're getting shot at from uh -huh. that direction, from that direction there, right? From that direction, eh? So you, you, you run. And you dive. Oh, wow. That looked painful. Uh, yeah, no, I'm, I'm good. Oh, God. Are you sure you didn't knock oh. your forehead on that, that small no, rock there? No, I'm good. Because it, it <clears throat> don't sound quite like you're good. <clears throat> you know, I'm just, just got the wind, you know. It's got, you got to you gotta hold your breath when you hit the, hit the ground. Give me a second. Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> Pretty sure. I'm, I'm good. You know, I'm good. You could have just gone and leaped. <sighs> hey, hey, hey what? what? You're not on duty right now. What are you doing? I'm just looking at you. I mean, no, no, <laughs> this is your downtime, sweetheart. You can't be going around investigating shit. Like I'm not investigating. It's just good to keep my. You know, keep away. What are you gonna do? You see a criminal, and then you're gonna be like, "Boy, we gotta go. We gotta go to a telegram office." It depends on the criminal. Holy shit! I think I see Gavin Summers. It's not Gavin Summers. It's a lass. Is he? He's wearing all black. Is that him? No, it's a lass wearing a pink the, shirt. No, at the ranch. At the ranch, there's a bunch of people in black. Is that them? I don't see anything. No, I don't think they'd be there. Now you see uh, over in the barn, next to the barn, to the left. To the, Are you I can't believe you actually. I cannot. Be, I cannot believe you actually fucking looking. <laughs> okay. Listen, if it was... How did I guess that some outlaw guy would be wearing black? By the way, that's because that's all they wear. That's all they fucking wear is fucking black, black, black. <laughs> Ooh, you're so scary with your black attire. I mean. Aye, but it also makes them look like every other outlaw. So when they go, oh, there was a bad person, they robbed me. What were they wearing? Black. Okay, I'll go add that to the list of the other 35 people wearing black going around robbing people. You know, it's, effect it's an effective strategy. Fuck me. Can't wait. Description. Black well, hat, that's why black coat, I, black I'll pants. get really detailed if I can. If I'm sitting there talking to someone and I know I won't be able to take them in right then, I take specific note of the details of what they're wearing. Like, mm -hmm. if I was looking at you... I would take special right. note of the fact that you're wearing your trousers over your boots and not the other way around. That uh, you, buttons, you notice, that by the way, striped. I got the lighter pants like you said. Aye. You see? Aye, it looks nice. Looks good? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I thought so. So, um, I was on the train today. Aye. I know. And, uh, some guy named Diego called me a criminal. Why did he call I said, you? I'm not a criminal. And he says, oh, I'm sorry. It must just run in the blood. Yeah, yeah, he doesn't like me very much. Does he have particular experience with Baz or with Danny or something like that? I don't fucking know. No idea. He was just being a little nasty is all. I bit my tongue though. I, I I went to the back of the train. Probably for the best. Yeah, yeah. I somewhat that he was smart enough to other people too, though. It seems like. What do you mean? There was a. Um, there was a. It seems like Jimothy got back from somewhere. He was sitting out there, and he was sort of getting touchy with him too. Oh right, right. Ad was sitting he's got there. a bit of a he's got a bit of lip on him, yeah. Ad was sitting there chatting with Jimothy, and uh, Diego had to walk away before he started something because he was getting lippy. Hey? 
I think he might like Ed, maybe. Oh, uh, he might. He might, actually, he might. Yeah, yeah, because oh, I was talking to Ed, and I think that's why he was getting all hostile. <laughs> it's all right, mm -hmm. though. What are you saying? Mm hmm, like that for? I mean, I. I, 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 I. What? You agree with me? Aye, I do. I think that he. Oh. There's a good chance that he does. Oh. Well, then they they should probably, you know, maybe they should try. I don't I don't know. Maybe involved. In... Oh, sorry. Not, I don't know. A dinner can. <laughs> Please don't. You know that that is what, what everyone in the entire department picks on me for what they just will the dinner be... can situation i dinner can i at no I ain't picking dinner on you. it's adorable i like it hey but just wait till you're riding with you know five other lawmen and they're shouting i dinner can and stuff All like right, that well, if they like... start making fun of you i might get a little upset oh don't be good enough i've got you know i can't make it as far as i have but getting upset every time i, I get made fun of you know have yeah, a I know, but and all that. That, that, but that I can get in there. I can do my uh, my law voice. Oh, your law voice! You've got law voice already. Oi! Oi! <laughs> Oi. Like that. I think that's, that's that's pretty much my thing. Unfortunately, yeah. when I get really forceful with my voice, I think that people have a hard time understanding sometimes. What'd you say? <laughs> uh huh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. I still remember <laughs> there was a time that the train was being robbed like the actual train was being stolen by this fellow named Clay was it Clay Davis? No it was Bridget Davis his wife Bridget Davis was still in the train I met her today you met her today? I haven't seen her around for yeah. ages she was on the train apparently she's learned to be a conductor or something I think it's a <laughs> whole bunch of <laughs> bullshit yeah <laughs> she's She's obsessed with robbing the train. She says whenever the train's running, she can't help but but go and, and rob it. Huh. Yeah, that's what I said to, to, to Ed. <laughs> I said, I don't think she's here to actually learn how to be on the train. She's working something out. Because I had just arrested her because she is wanted for something else. I <laughs> tackled her in roads and brought her into the office and I gave her... A fairly nice break on stuff because she wasn't being too difficult. All right. She gets let out, immediately goes and gets together with Kaneko and robs the train. Hmm. And so I'm, I, I'm, I heard that they're going and so I had to dunk on how I managed it. But I got Odysseus there and I managed to ride all the way around uh, Sandini from Rhodes and I caught up with the train on the other side. Because I saw everyone going, I managed to cut, cut off the train at the, at the front of it, and I jumped off my horse onto the coal wagon, where Kanek, Low, and Bridget were. And I just remember you're that. a fucking hero. No, not really. I mean, at that point, at that point, I stood up there, and there, everyone's kind of like, "All right, now what?" And then the train ran out of coal and ground to a stop, and they all left. No, <laughs> that'll do it. I was very lucky; I didn't get shot. Look at that mountain. Which you reckon, one? You reckon, you reckon, right you, the left. Yeah, the tall one. To the left, behind the, the ranch. <laughs> Mount Hagen. You can climb up there. Mm-hmm. Phelan, thank you so much for the raid. I'd love to climb up there one day. I hope you had a good stream. Maybe will let me know uh, one day. I crawled all over it doing treasure hunting. Did a lot of... Exploring the crossing while I waited for my badge. While I pursued it. That's how I got robbed by Gavin Summers right out here at that ranch. Oh, lovely. Um. <laughs> you got caught not going to bed, Crit Witch. I like this. Valley. Um. Well, that too. Uh... 
to ask you a question. Of course. I know you're going for your badge. And you're waiting for that interview. If it doesn't work out right away, what what are you going to do? We'll see see oh. you get a rejection notice. And they say, we'll let you know when we think that you're a good fit. I've been thinking about that. I was thinking maybe if that happens, I could continue... Uh... You know, doing my carpentry work. There's a big job down in Saint Denis. Okay. Uh, yeah, the a big manor got blown up. The whole front of it completely oh. fucking destroyed. Okay. I heard about. And that. I'm, I might be getting hired to to repair that. That's a big, big job. I'm gonna require quite a few uh, men to do that. It's like we could do that. Mm -hmm. um, and also, I was also thinking maybe uh, like train security, maybe. Oh, hey, train scare. I know when I first came on the crossing, that was a bigger thing than that is now. And I nearly did tr sign up as train security for some time. Yeah, I just wanted, like, you know, like, uh, just make honest money, you know? Hey, hey. I mean, I, like I said, I worked for the paper for about a week and a half. I liked it, though. It was pretty exciting. I could probably write for the paper. I reckon I'd be. I reckon I'd be a good writer. Well, I could get you an interview with Queen Earth if you ever. Yeah, want yeah, that. I could probably do it. I think I'd be pretty. I'd. I'd be a good journalist. I reckon I could get all the scoops. <laughs> really? Or are you just seeing that? I'm just, just saying that honestly. <laughs> like, I mean. I mean, sometimes I get... you can you look at the the quality of the rating. <laughs> Sorry, do you, do you get what? You making fun of the quality of the writing? Which what? Which not what, yours, what's not writing? Not yours. I'm talking about people in the paper. Sometimes. Oh right, just... right, right. Uh, well, you know, I just. I mean, if I did the paper, does it mean I get to interview you? I mean, you could interview me if you wanted to, I suppose. I did stuff like that when I was interview when I was at the paper. I went to interview different lawmen on their stories. I did a lot of different stories and stuff. I wanted to interview uh, criminals. I had this whole idea for a. Actually, that was the first thing. I played for the newspaper ages ago, and they rejected me. An idea for a newspaper for a column, essentially called Behind the Mask. I went behind the badge where I went to interview people who were, you know, well-known criminals and well-known women and find out, you know, basic human things about them. You know, like, what's your favourite food? Did you have any pets growing up? That sort of stuff. Right, right. But, uh... They weren't interested, I suppose. We went closer. You you found you found your place though you know you found what you're really good at. Oh, yeah, I think so. I hope so. How? What? Classy? What are you talking about? No. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Did you get my notes back? It's not power gaming. What the fuck? Hi. <laughs> I uh, I never get fucking nervous. What the fuck? <laughs> Sorry. Nah, it's... You know, I'm. I, it's my fault. I try and be intimidating as part of my job. You know. It's not that you're intimidating. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, trust me. Um... You, you're not. You're not scaring me. All right. I'm just, I mean, I'm just enjoying myself, is all. Well, there's nothing wrong with that. You got shot. Welcome to day one. 
<laughs> Toffs, dandelion toffs keep flying in my mouth and I've got to spit them out over oh, and over oh, again. Oh, no, okay. Well, I want... so, sorry. Yeah, I mean, we, we can move if you like. <laughs> no, it's all right. We can go somewhere else. I can follow another road. Don't know where it's going to lead. It would be somewhere nice. Uh, you got to be careful about also, that here, you know. It be a cliff, too. Well, I mean, it'd be nice if we could not go riding off a cliff. Well, that would be ideal. Yeah. What are you doing? Just looking at turkeys. Uh, yeah, right. Did you no, see some moving no, in the shrubbery? No, is that is that what? Tur is it summers? I, no, I see turkeys moving in the shrubbery. Look right there. There's two turkeys. Right. Okay. So you got up to look at the turkeys. Aye. And the coyotes. See them right there. Look. Okay. If there were a group of armed gunmen sneaking up on us, wouldn't you want me to be aware of it so that we could get away from them? Well, you don't think I could spot them? That's not what I'm saying at all, but... I'm a good spotter. Two pairs of eyes are always better than one. All right, then. Let's see if you can see me. You turn around. I'll hide somewhere over there, and you, you see if you can see me. That can be very difficult if you hide in the bushes. If you're Give me not, ten seconds. If you're not moving... Okay. Turn around. Close your eyes. All right. Close your eyes. All right. You're not closing your eyes. I'm closing my eyes. All right. Wait, how long am I supposed to wait? Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And now it's getting dark. Oh. Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so much. <laughs> I hate that. I didn't. Like... I hate myself That's for right. that. I'm That's ashamed. Right. I'm ashamed of myself. I'm so ashamed of myself. Oh, I'm so glad you're looking on the horizon I'm for all those so bad guys coming to get us. Ashamed. Get one skin, Doc. Oh yes. <laughs> He Must always look like down. Him. Lesson number one. No, I really should have thought to do that, but I thought, oh, he must have ran off. Uh huh, uh huh. Expect the unexpected. You're right, you're right. You got me. That's all. Oh, that's, yeah. That's all right. No, that's all right. That's all right. Go on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, by the way, you know Domino. Uh huh. Yeah, he's dead. Wait, what? How? He lasted one fucking day. I tried to jump over a fence. He, he just took a head around to the fucking fence post. Oh, dead. I'm so sorry. He was such a gorgeous horse. <sighs> yeah, well, he's in a hole now. I'm going to have to fucking buy another one. Thousand bucks it cost me. <sighs> hey, those turk ones are very expensive. I looked at getting one of those Perolino ones before, but... Uh... Odysseus is sort of my quota for a bright white horse. Actually, I was worried about that. Didn't have time to change horses, and we had a situation where we where we needed to be sneaking through the bushes up on some people today. And uh, my first oh. thought was, "Oh no, I've got a bright white horse." So if we follow this road, we'll go back towards Strawberry. Yeah, we can get a Strawberry. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know. Uh, what's in strawberry? But I can probably get you a coffee. Hi, probably. Take the right here. Yeah, I know where to. I know okay, it's strawberry. Well, I didn't know All you right. said that you didn't know your way around the cross, and so I was trying to help you out. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm leading. I'm leading this patrol. Okay, I'll let you lead the patrol. All right, you watch and learn. I am going to look at my map once. I'm terrible about this. 
if you ever meet uh, Deputy Briar, she'll complain about how uh, I said she could lead the patrol once and then I said, oh, you're going this way, really? Okay. <laughs> I can I'm see terrible. I can I can see you being that kind of person. <laughs> I didn't mean it that way. Hold on. Oh fuck. Uh I've got this, I got this. <coughs> right. <coughs> right. <coughs> yeah, it's right. Oh, yeah. Dang. So it is. Yeah, yeah, and I know where I'm going. Say my first rodeo. <laughs> what do you use rest? Uh. Mm, so this is Monty's rest up here. Yeah, yeah, we're just taking the scenic route. So just stop. There's a cliff. There's. No, the no, cliff. I see it. I see. It. I see the cliff. Well, just, yeah, just, just having a look at the view. I just wanted to see the view. Look at that. Beautiful. Huh? Look at that. You don't see that every day, do you? No. Ah, that's nice. Alright, back to strawberry. <laughs> Andy. Alright, now we chuckle right over here. That's right. Yes. There you go. The strawberry. You ever get your rights and lefts mixed up? No. no. I do. Get right every time. Well, that's good. I mean, you do. Well, you know what? I, mostly when I say, when I want to say that I'm going to the right, I, I've got to think about it again. Because I think on some day of being left handed, you know? I just right, think right, right. backwards. And mm. I yeah, I've heard about left handers. Do you know back in like the old days? If you were like a left-handed, they would have thought you were a witch. Oh, yeah. And what they would have done, they would have they would have they would have tied you up and thrown you in the river. If you floated, <laughs> they 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 would they would assume that you were a witch and they'd chop your head off. Or if you sunk, it means you weren't a witch, but unfortunately, you you, you sunk. Hey, Unfortunate. That's terrible. That doesn't make any sense. There's also another test you used to do too. They used to get an axe and they they chop your head off. If it bounced off, you weren't a witch. And you were, I mean, you were a witch, and they'd execute you, or they'd burn you. But if they didn't bounce off your neck, you're innocent. The, yeah, those were the days. So you just die no matter what? Yeah, if you get accused of being a witch, you, you're pretty much fucked. I yeah. would be happy to help you rehome it. But I tell you what, it was a great way to get back at your enemies. You know, if you ever had, like, a bitch neighbor, right? You just Stole say, witch. witch! Yeah, that's and that's terrible. it. You're, they're fucked. Yeah. I wonder how much that happened. That probably happened a lot, right? Probably. It was probably mainly <laughs> used by people to... Spiteful witch. ...have a reason to go after others. No doubt. Alright. I'ma walk over and get some water right up here. Yeah, I'll get you a coffee. Alright. mean right left but your brain auto switches the opposite and it relays to your mouth it's a, yeah it's I, I don't know what happened it's something like that Go left, the other left. Yep. Oh, there, is it? It's a thing. It's a. It's a thing that people have. That's funny. I don't know. Sorry. Are you right? Is it? You know any good spots to drink? Um. In, the in this here town. Is pretty nice, sorta. I mean, everything here is pretty. Yeah. pretty. There's actually a torch over here. There. Up on. Maybe oh, over. Right, right, right. Yeah. Maybe over here. Yeah.
Oh, well, that cat is falling. Oh, little, little bad. kitty. Give me. Oh, you little thing. Aren't you adorable? He's cute. Yeah, the cats always follow me around. Really? I don't know why. Yeah, I don't know why. Cats just love me. <laughs> Alright, where are we going to this? Over here, I guess? Oh, sweet. Hey, you know. There we go. I know, that's what's so here funny. It's pretty nice, eh? Yeah, it's not bad. I got you a chocolate too, I hope you don't mind. Oh, thank you. No, I love chocolate. <sighs> and uh, you, you said that everything worked out with him. Eugene and all that. Yeah, that was rough. So, uh, the day you told me, I went back there later that night to do some work. And, uh, well, uh, Christine, she had, uh, recently been attacked by uh, a bear. So she was on the mend, but I think she had an infection. So she was a little bit loopy and she was collapsing all over the place. And, uh,. Oh you know, I helped her into bed. I gave her a blanket. Um, then she started to get worse, so I carried her over to the doctor. Called a doctor in to help her out. Then uh, I told uh, um, one of her helpers. I can't remember the name now. I told her to go tell her son to come see his mother because it looked like she was going to die, honestly. I and Tommy know. was playing black, uh, not blackjack, poker. So she runs over to go get Tommy. She comes back and says, he, Tommy seemed more annoyed that I disrupted his poker game and he's not coming over. So I went over there and I told him to come over and see his fucking mother. And so he did. And, uh, she seemed pretty happy. She called me Baz three times. Uh, and then she went to sleep and and I left. I tell you this much though, I it took a a lot to help those people. But was it the but, right thing to do? Well, that's the thing. I kept uh, every time I thought about you know just walking away and leaving her and not caring like fuck her sort of thing i thought about what you said i thought about you and it calmed me down and uh, i i knew that helping was the right thing to do it gets like that a lot oh boy you're gonna have to deal with people who were shooting at you the week before maybe they did shoot you maybe they shot you down Maybe they killed a friend of yours. But now they're in another situation where they're going, woe is me, I need help. I need help. Oh, and it's, yeah. That's never easy. No, no it's not. It's something personal. No, no, I... I fully admit I, I'm not perfect. I definitely treat Christine and Eugene and everyone else associate with them with more prejudice than I would. I, I tend to be harsher. Well that's um, more than they deserve. I'm also studying all the routes around the crossing to make sure to avoid all bridges. 
just in case you no 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 just in case there's ever a situation where you need help and i gotta come get you or something i ain't i'm gonna make sure i know the the, the perfect route people don't really know about that well i ain't gonna tell no one it's our it's our secret Well, um, I promise I ain't gonna say nothing. I'm just really afraid that it's gonna prevent me from doing something when it really matters. There's been no. three times that I've come up, you know, there's a split suspension bridge outside of Valentine. It's a swinging one that hangs over the, the river gorge. Yeah, I know it. And people who rob the bank and Valentine love to go darting across that. It's it's Mine. it's insanity to actually ride a horse across it, anyways. But I've, I've how often do they use it? Almost every time. I think ne and next time I I'm responding to a Valentine big robbery, I'm gonna take a wagon over there and block it off. That's what I was gonna say. Why don't you fellas just block that fucking thing off? I'm going. I'm going to be doing it, but you know, not everyone has different ideas of how they do things, and it depends on a lot mm. of different factors. And, but that's what I'm going to do. I'll we'll go get one of the the police wagons, and I'll just back it up right in there. Maybe even release the horses off of it. Completely block that avenue of escape because it's dangerous. Sounds smart. Try going. Um, one time we went over there, and and as soon as we got up there, there were people rode across, and they had people on the other side shooting at us. No shit. That was him. <laughs> Those fucking cowards. <laughs> you just never know what people are going to do. You've got to be prepared for everything. I expect the unexpected, like I should have back at that rock. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You never know when someone's going to jump out and go, boo! <laughs> seem to be good at startling me. What we, are you ever going to tell me what that was about? The, what, 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 what? When I went to the telegram station and suddenly you're worming your way out, crawling around and acting all shifty. I mean, I can tell you, but it's a little embarrassing. I mean, how embarrassing is embarrassing? <sighs> Alright, well... Basically, um, you know, I told you I'd, I'm not one to get attached or want anything more than just, you know, an evening or two. Hi. Well, uh, the time I saw you and we spent time together, I, uh, I was feeling like, like I wanted more than, than just that and... I was, um, trying to avoid that feeling. You kept speaking. Well, yeah, I mean, I couldn't help myself at the end, could I? I was just curious if you, you think I don't notice people's change in behavior and tone. I mean, that's a lot of what my job entails, eh? <clears throat> You're telling me slivering around on my belly wasn't obvious enough? You need to have a <laughs> fucking job and a badge to figure that one out? No, no, I mean, more of how you acted after the fact, you know? People do weird things well, yeah. here all the time. <laughs> I was just, I was just scared of liking you too much, is all. I'm not used to it. It's fair. Neither am I. Yeah, it's very colorful.
It's nice to get in the sea again. Have to, yeah. Have to see how your jobs are going and stuff like that. And you haven't heard. Uh, yeah, you can, you, you can, you can watch me work one day. Why? Maybe. I mean, you know, I, I get all hot and bothered. Well, I wouldn't you know, want you. But I wouldn't want that to be the case. Eh? Maybe I'm a, well, well that's window. what. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a hard worker. But um. You know, it's getting a little late. I should probably take you back home, right? Hi, that's definitely something to Yeah. All right. Let me take you back home, me lady. Oh. You don't need to use that phrase. That's a very formal thing. Like, I read in a book once. Very formal and. Oh, howdy. Well, you don't like formalities. Uh, you come across as a formal lady. I mean. Like stuff proper. Did I kind of about four? Oh, well, about four. Oh, watch out! That's uh, all right. Bert's <laughs> uh, gonna be such a troll. It's great. Yeah, but you know, it's um, it's a, it's a very classy thing. I read in a very classy book. Uh huh. That's right. I'm trying to be a gentleman. No, nothing wrong with that. I appreciate it. Now watch this. Watch Ooh, how I get us. Oh, no, no, no. It's all right. No, I saw that coming. Watch me get us all the way to black water without a problem. All right. <laughs> Hopefully there's just no packs of wolves down here. All right. We're going to take a right here. Yeah. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. I'm gonna go all the way down. And this should take us to the burnt building. Right? Mm hmm. Oh, good. Alright, don't worry about wolves. We're gonna be fine. We're not too worried, I just. Know, I've grown aware of where they tend to linger, you know? Yeah. Yeah, me do. Now, down at this end, you, if you cross the river here, you got to keep keep an eye out for the uh, the cougar. Cougar, yeah. Um, that lingers outside the branch. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. actually went out here looking to hunt a cougar up the other day and found a fella sprawled out, having been attacked. Had to bring him into town instead. Yeah, I'll go get myself a, uh, a long arm, I think. Still don't own one. You don't own one? No. Nah. I could, uh, got two lich fields. I could, I could lend you one if you wanted. Ah, uh, no, nah, I, 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 you know, I don't hunt or nothing, and... Oh, you, you don't hunt? You know. No, no, I, I'm too busy working, awesome. ain't I? Thank you so much for the raid. Hey, guys. Thank you. Um, oh, my that's goodness. That's what I do. Of course, we're kind of headed back towards town, but... Hey, guys. I hope you had a great stream. Right. Driver, thank you for the resub. Right, right, right. Ten months. That's nuts. Well, you know, the offer's there. If you did want to go hunting or something like that, that's... Well, maybe we should go hunting sometime. Hey, That'd be great. I'd, I'd like that. I've got a bolt action so we can try... Ah! Go after beers! It, it's, it's just a couple of shrubs, right? A little I... shrubbery. Doesn't hurt nobody. <laughs> oh, listen. That scratched on my face. That's why he made a sound. Let's <laughs> hit my face first, all right? Come on. You got shot. You're getting the, uh, the, the backlash. Thanks. <laughs> Some shrapnel. Shrapnel, shrub shrapnel. That's right. Here we are, Braham in one piece. Look at that. Impressive. You know what I found out, and I'm a wee bit, I'm not sure how I feel about it. There's sort of, you know, multiple rooms at this place. Mm -hmm. And apparently, one of my co workers, they, they just says, this says to me, oh, I. 
do you know what other deputy is staying over at this shot? house over here where I'm what staying at? It's like, I, I have been for months. Ah, <sighs> turns out she's the one who was ripping down my things that I had posted up. Well, kick her out. Uh, oh, whoa. Well, I mean, I can't kick her out. We're both renting out the same place. There's more than one room. You know, this is Lucy, right? <laughs> oh, definitely isn't the, um... The Give me a second. The place to stay in the, in the crossing. Alright, guys, thank you for coming over. Alright, I'll fix this for you. Hold on. Alright. I, uh, I, I suppose the landlord probably won't notice. It's so funny that he's got... Huh? There you are. Did Good you leave you. did you leave this here by the way? <laughs> yeah that yeah, that was me. It's nothing to be ashamed of. I was just curious. I'm not no, I'm not ashamed of it. Yeah. <clears throat> uh anyway. It was a lovely evening. Uh, hope you enjoyed yourself, and I hope to do this again in the not so distant future. Hey, you have to. I like going out and doing things, so it's just a. a there's something that happens when you don't have anyone to go out and do the things with, you know. You just sort of stop doing things. Whether that's going to events or whatever. Well, you have a lovely night and get some rest. You've had a big day. Okay, you too. Good night, Boyd. Good night, Seth. try and find something to eat because Grubhub stood me up. <laughs> oh well, hopefully it's not like Baz and Riggs because that would be very sad. In so many ways. We have a different story than Baz and Riggs. Guys, thank you for hanging out. Right, RB for seven hours on a cheese stick. Yeah, I know. I was gonna get food. I tried. But I, I got... I got tricked, got stood up. Alright, well, thank you, Solid Sin, for the raid and everyone else. Uh, thanks for coming by. I'm going to find somebody to raid just to continue. Oh, there's Julius Bradshaw. You know what? I'm going to throw you guys at him. I don't know what he's up to, but he had some spicy stuff go on today. Maybe he'll be able to fill you in on it more. Um, yeah. Looks like there's some people watching now, so maybe some in interesting things are happening. I need to go get my poor doggies and, yeah, make myself some ramen at past midnight. Midnight 30. <laughs> Alright, guys. Sending you off. Good night. <laughs>